We're going to multiply a couple more binomials here. Uh, I have 2x minus 5 times x plus 2. And I want to uh, I want to multiply that. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this binomial, the first one, and I'm going to distribute it over the second one. Okay? So that means I'm going to say this equals x times 2x minus 5 plus 2 times 2x minus 5. And that gets me x times 2x is 2x squared. Negative 5 times x is minus 5. Plus 2 times 2x, that's going to be plus 4x. And a positive 2 times a negative 5 gets me minus 10. And now all I... Hey, hold it. x times negative 5 is minus 5x. Sorry about that. Okay, now that looks a little better. Okay, so now all I have to do is combine these like terms here. And what I see I have is 2x squared minus x minus 10. Now one thing I want to point out is I didn't have to multiply, I didn't have to distribute this one across the other one. I could have distributed this one. So let's see how that would work. Uh, we would have 2x minus 5 times x plus 2 equals 2x times x plus 2 minus 5 times x plus 2. You see what I did? Took the x plus 2 and treated it as one entity and said, I'm distributing this across this binomial here. Alrighty. 2x times x, 2x squared. 2x times 2, 4x. Negative 5 times x is minus 5x, and negative 5 times 2 is minus 10. And what you can see is, I got the exact same terms here that I got here. So this is going to give me, of course, the exact same answer when I combine these like terms, and that is 2x squared minus x minus 10. And that's our answer. So as you can see, you can distribute it either way. Uh, you can start it off either way, and you're going to get the exact same answer.